And finally tonight, 9-11 is a day we will never forget. But for many students, all they know is what they've seen in history books and videos. 10 News reporter Katie Edmond shows us how Anderson County Schools is making sure that memory stays alive. The day of September 11, 2001, a tragedy happened in New York City. Terrorists used planes to try to kill citizens of the USA. Firefighters, police, and paramedics came to help. For the fifth grade students at Grand Oaks Elementary, 9-11 will always be a piece of history, never a memory. Like it's something that people always need to remember in the USA because it's a day that many people were lost and injured. But that didn't stop them from writing speeches and thanking first responders during a ceremony. Patriots Day is a day to remember all the people who helped us. Down the road at Anderson County High School, 18 years ago on the morning of September 11, 2001. The timeline was read on the morning announcements and students played taps. Uh, you know, you kind of get a lump in your throat um, when, you, when you start thinking about that. The kids may be older, but only a select few were even born when the Twin Towers went down. Uh, and so I think you need to enlighten them and, and make sure that they don't Forget this. Now they watch clips from that day in class, the heartache flashing in their eyes. Uh, because once we stop doing that, uh, they're going to forget about it. We don't want them to forget about it. Even though many of the students weren't alive 18 years ago, they understand the need to say thank you. Thanks to police and firefighters, we are now safe in all places. In Anderson County, that then our country would not be the same. Katie and Men, 10 News. A fitting tribute. Anderson County Schools has done this Patriot Day program and 9-11 announcements for more than a dozen years and something they'll continue to do. Loved the tribute. So heartfelt there.